e te atua mo te kura, mo mai to tautoko, to āwhina, to wairua, ki a tātou kato. Nō reira, ki a mau te mana o kaitaku whanui, mo ake, ake, ake. Āmene. Welcome. Welcome to our staff, students and our wider family on the live stream. It's a privilege to be here as a board chair breaking you good news. Since Mrs Duthie retired, announced her retirement at last year's senior prize giving, we've been through an extensive search to find the right person to lead Columbia College for the foreseeable future. Many of you have contributed to those discussions and helped us understand the needs of the college going forwards. Columbus principal will always be an outstanding teacher and educational leader. For us, that is a minimum standard. But in addition, they also need to be able to understand and be able to navigate the challenges that our staff and students face going forwards. We're living in a complex world, a world recovering from a pandemic and the associated economic turmoil, social media stereotypes and education by chat GPT. Columbus very DNA is not just about providing the three R's of education, reading, writing and arithmetic, but a holistic education, caring about every student and encouraging everyone to work together to achieve excellence by being the best we can possibly be. In addition to that, we need someone who understands how special this college is, who is passionate about Columba and deeply loves the school. A global search led to a high number of high quality applicants. We went through an extensive <coughs> interview process involving board members, former principals and school leaders, old girls, and our student representative. And right through this process, one inspirational leader stood out to us. Today, we are looking forward to announcing the appointment of an innovative and visionary leader with broad experience across both education and community sectors. She has a, re a proven reputation for creating inspiring and optimistic environments where young people and their communities thrive. And she is absolutely passionate about Columba. In fact, the hall that we are in right now was designed by her great-grandfather. I'm going to hand over to Mrs Julia Scott, Chair of the Board, Board of Schools, to make the announcement. Our new principal has been, so that you know, that our new principal has been the head of a private middle school of 450 day and border students in the United Kingdom. She has been the head of a department of a prestigious New Zealand girls private school. She's been a house mistress in a boarding school and she's lived on site at a boarding, in the boarding house for quite some time with all of those girls. She has a degree as a specialist teacher in maths, physics, music and theology. She is also a tertiary level educator and she is a nationally recognised conference presenter. In addition, she works as a governance trustee on a New Zealand board of a national organisation. And by the end of this year, we anticipate that she will also be a published author. Most importantly for Columba, she has a full motorbike licence and she owns a blue Peugeot motorbike that will soon be parked in our principal car park. We are really excited and we are genuinely, genuinely thrilled about the future of the college. We are very proud to announce to you today that the outstanding new principal of Columba College is going to be Mrs Carissa Nicholl. And we'll stand <laughs> Things that go on around here 
and the energy and ethos that infuses it all. Columba has a deserved reputation of excellence in academics, sport and the arts. When I popped into school last weekend, the band was playing an awesome original song. The choir was getting sorted for the big sing. And when I came to see the Mamma Mia actors, my first reaction was, whoa, what's going on here? Um, because I found them mastering the art of on-stage hugging. <coughs> There's never a dull moment here at Columba, and I can't wait to join with our staff and community to support all aspects of this diverse experience that makes up life at Columba. This remarkable place with a rich history and a very special character. I am so excited to join with it and work together with you all to enable this community to continue to go from strength to strength. I am passionate about flourishing communities. My vision is that together we grow in competence and connection with one another and with the wider community. And so I am really looking forward to beginning in term four, leading this thriving community on the next stage of its journey. I can't wait to get started. Kia to te rangimārie. Peace be with you. Thank you.
Thank you.